Okay, I'm Piper Rungi. I'm one of the dollies in Hello Dolly. I'm Indigo Rungi. I am the other dolly. Notice the same last name. It's not a coincidence. <laughs> so we're sisters. Um, we're really excited to be yes. playing this role together. Okay, so both of us have been involved in theater since a really young age. Um, our parents both do it, so we've been doing it since as long as we can remember. Whether it was three-year-old Indy and The Sound of Music, or little five-year-old me and Brigadoon or whatever. Yeah. There are a lot of responsibilities when you're an actor, especially an actor with a part, because it's not just learning all the dances that you do for ensemble numbers and that many people are in, but it's also learning your own songs when you have to sing alone and learning all your lines. Lines are a big thing to learn. That is personally my hardest part. It's such a great community because you get a very, you get a pretty different mix of people than you get from just the main stage play. Um, because you get like the actors, but you also get the dancers and the singers, and it's really fun to put all these people together and create something like so grand and large scale. And it's just so fun, like putting, because there's so many little pieces, like the music and the dancing and the acting, and then all, it all just melds together. And then there's no show without every person in that cast. Every person, whether some one person has to learn more, they are equally as important as any other member because. We are a machine that needs every single part that we have. That's a good analogy. Thanks. Yeah. Dolly Levi is a middle-aged, widowed matchmaker. Um, so she sets up couples who get married, and it takes place in the late 19th century. So, like, that's kind of the setting, and she's she's arranging all of these mischievous little details of life and whatever. But a big part about Dolly is that she has this kind of gimmick where she just hands out cards because she can do everything. Uh, she can, like, some examples are re-boning corsets, <laughs> pierced to ears, re-plugged. She literally has a card for everything, and she's just such a multi-purpose woman that she can she doesn't need anyone to help her with anything she can do it all she has a card for dancing and if you want to see that card be put to use come see the show there's a whole scene about it so that's fun my favorite thing about dolly is how she always knows everything that's going on even if she seems kind of unsuspecting and innocent she knows dolly always knows so, yeah so it's so fun playing a strong character especially like in this time period because the strong characters, strong female characters are always the best. And if you put them in like a time period that's so far away and you still get these epic sets and costumes and a strong female lead, like it's perfect. What more could you ask? I mean, another thing about the plot. Okay, so even though there is this like great strong female character that is Dolly, if you still are a sucker for, a sucker for romance, there's some thrown in there with Cornelius and Irene and some pretty songs that and I Barbie love. and Minnie. Oh, and Barbie and Minnie. Yeah, they're, they're so cute. They're the cute little young couple. So there is still romance. There's just also still strong female power. And we might also have romance too. Yeah. Just, yeah. Just, yeah. just a little, maybe a bit. Yeah. Yeah, come see both of us. Come see the sister duo on separate nights, but it's still really fun. It's really cool just getting to work every single day in the show with your best friend. Aww.